Chicago Sky guard Chennedy Carter stirred controversy by publicly criticizing Indiana Fever rookie guard Caitlin Clark on the social media platform threads. The incident followed the Sky's narrow 71-70 loss to the Fever on Saturday. Carter's remarks were in response to a post that included her post-game media comments, which were subsequently shared by the Athletics' Nicole Auerbach on her ex-account. Carter expressed her opinion on Clark's overall game, writing, and that's that on that cause beside three-point shooting what does she bring to the table man? This comment came after a physical altercation during the game, where Carter was assessed and away from the play foul for body-checking Clark just before the end of the third quarter. The WNBA later upgraded this to a flagrant one foul upon review, though Carter avoided a fine. The incident gained further attention as Carter refused to discuss the foul during her post-game interview. I ain't answering no Caitlin Clark questions. I don't know what she said. I didn't say anything, she told reporters, declining to elaborate on the sequence or the ensuing social media exchange. The altercation and Carter's subsequent comments generated a wide range of reactions from WNBA fans. Some viewed Carter's actions and remarks as crossing a line, while others interpreted them as a sign of jealousy towards Clark, who has been a standout in her rookie season. Clark herself addressed the foul during an in-game interview with ESPN, stating, Yeah, that's just not a basketball play. But you know, I've got to play through it, that's what basketball is about at this level. Her composure and focus drew praise from Fever head coach Christy Sides, who took to social media to call the foul, unacceptable, and criticize the league's handling of such incidents. This is unacceptable WNBA. When will the consistent complaints be heard? Something has to be done. Sides posted on X she further commended Clark for her resilience and ability to remain composed under physical pressure highlighting her determination and strength. Clark's performance in the game was notable as she contributed 11 points, 8 rebounds, 6 assists, and 1 steal, despite the physical play against her. She shot 4 for 11 from the field, including 2 of 9 from 3-point range. Clark's efforts also earned her a place in WNBA history, joining Sabrina Ionescu as the only players to achieve 150-plus points, 50-plus rebounds, and 50-plus assists in their first 10 career games. The Fever's win and Clark's continued success were underscored by the support from her coach and teammates. Sides emphasized the importance of sending footage of these plays to the league in hopes of prompting more consistent officiating and protection for players like Clark. Looking ahead, Clark and the Fever are set to face the New York Liberty in a primetime game on NBA TV. The attention on this matchup is likely to be heightened following the recent controversy and Clark's impressive rookie campaign. This story was originally reported by Josh Helmer for Hawkeye's Wire, where ongoing coverage of Iowa news, notes, and opinions can be followed.